Hey guys, what's going on? Hope everyone's doing great, finishing up a great weekend. And uh, thanks so much for reading the blog or tuning into the video here. Um, really appreciate everyone constantly uh, listening or reading uh, what we have to say. And uh, I figured this blog post would be a little bit of departure from what we've been throwing up there. Um, took me a little while to get going. I promise I started writing it at the end of the summer. And now we're, uh, you know, into October here a little bit. So it was close. I almost got it done on time. Um, but I figured it would be a good opportunity to take a look back at some things. And selfishly, as I sort of said in the blog, uh, one thing for me is this is a great way to look back. You know, I've looked back a couple times at some of the things that I wrote in the blog early on, uh, you know, March and April and what was going on then. And uh, this has been a great way to um, do that. So I figured I would throw something in there about my sort of reflections on the summer and what, uh, you know, what happened there um, and what we did. And, you know, I think we got to have a really, really great summer with the kids. We got to do a lot of things that maybe we wouldn't normally get to do or things that we wouldn't normally get to do for quite as much. Um, you know, or quite as many times, so it was great. And, um, you know, now as the fall sets in, it's great to sort of look back at the summer and realize that, uh, you know, we got to do a lot of things. We had a really, really great summer. And uh, most importantly, I don't think that, it, you know, anything going on sort of negatively impacted, um, you know, the kids' view on, on what was going on. Um, and personally, I got to get out and figure out how to mountain bike. I don't think I had been on a mountain bike since I was in college. Um, and oddly enough, I think I gave it up. I was afraid of getting hurt and got into road biking, which led me into running and triathlon. Um, and then that sort of led into marathons. And I don't know, I'd sort of been itching to maybe try it out, get back out there. Um, some of the new bikes looked a lot of, looked like a lot of fun. And I was in the bike shop and getting my road bike serviced and take, took a look at a mountain bike and couldn't pass up the opportunity. And I think really, you know, one big takeaway for me was, um, you know, this summer, everything going on, all the crazy things going on in the world. It's a really great opportunity to slow down and try and learn something new, try and learn a new skill. Um, you know, I think there's a lot of internet experts out there saying, don't waste this time. And, you know, you're going to regret all these things. And I don't know how much of that stuff is true, but um, I do think it's a great opportunity. And it was for me, um, I wasn't training for a race. I, wasn't like this was gonna cut into something else that I was doing. And it was a good opportunity to learn a new skill. Um, and I think you can grow a lot and make a lot of, you know, learning new things is something that you um, really can always benefit from. And it benefits you in so many more ways than in just whatever that new skill is that you learn. Um, and so it's something I try to do, you know, on a regular basis, but this was a little bit of a, of a bigger jump for me. And it was great, I had a blast, I got to, uh, spend extra time outside, be in the trails, be in the woods, um, you know, from a distancing thing, right? There's not a lot of people around out there. It was great. Um, and I, you know, escaped relatively injury free, a couple cuts and bruises and things like that. But, uh, I'm told you didn't try hard enough if you didn't fall. So I definitely tried hard enough. Um, and I'm told the fall is one of the most beautiful times to do it. So hopefully I'll be able to keep getting out there in the trails. Um, but yeah, you know, my big takeaway from this, uh, other than making sure to spend a little bit of extra time with the family, is to try something new. Try something you're not familiar with and try and learn a new skill. And uh, you never know what will come from come from that. So as the fall and winter approaches, pick something. Try something different. Try something you wouldn't normally try. Teach yourself something different. Um, and, uh, you know, go for it. Um, I'd love to hear what everyone's doing and sort of what you're, what you're going to try and do and how everyone's doing. So love keeping in touch with everybody. Um, in any way we can be, you know, be of service and help anybody out, please don't hesitate to reach out and uh, look forward to hopefully another one of these sort of retrospective ideas, you know, uh, looking back on the fall and get, getting into the winter because it'll be here before we know it and uh, it's time to get the skis ready. So enjoy, have a good one and uh, we'll talk to everyone soon.